Hey, it's Finnegan. I'm back for another Paleo tour. I'm here with Hermione. Hello, hello. This will be a little bit of a different tour. Um, it'll be just me today. And as our normal custom here, Hermione's our tour guide today. I'm going to be following her around. So where are we going? Where are we going first? I'll follow you. Already just like, I, I like the, the vibe of this right now. Just kind of I just love the, the masonry. Everything looks so well well laid out. We're gonna go over here first. We got the the mystical bird. Don't wanna spook it though. But Hermione's gonna be uh typing things out and I'll be reading them in chat, so I'll make sure to keep an eye out. But look at this workroom. That's very interesting. I haven't really seen this type of wallpaper being used on the inside. Nice and clean, nice and clean interior. Got everything that you need all laid out. Very, very nice. Nice little backyard area. So we're going to head inside the house. Ooh, here we go. Very colorful room. I like that uh, I've seen people do big trophy rooms, but sometimes, you know, this is this is really cool. You know, using this this type of application for nice little trophy room. Yeah, it's just kind of keep them away, you know, no big, no biggie. But yeah, this room here is is really cool. Just want to get all the all the angles. I like this little decoration, how you have it laid out. It's so creative how people incorporate bugs and everything into their designs and uh, tactical snacks. Looks like there was a, a game here. Who won? Who lost? Don't want to ask those questions. These are these are where people draw the line. Ooh, I like the rustication. That's really cool. I always love seeing people do the council of plushies too. Put a bunch of plushies in a court in a in a circle. They've reached a quorum. I love all the little little decorations on the outsides here. They dictate the menu. Ha ha ha. Yes. That's cool. That is really cool. Very well done. Very well done. Lots of earth tones, you know. That's it's always nice to see people do do earth tones in their designs. I love this. Nice little study nook. Listen to some music. Everybody has so many amazing builds. They're so creative. This little area here, I mean, come on, what what kind of luxury, just the pinnacle of luxury to have a couch in the bedroom right next to a tub, you know? The record player is one of your favorite things. That's awesome. That's awesome. We got here to the backyard. Excellent. Very cozy. Very cozy. Still, so many, so many things to point out, so many things to kind of uh, take a look at. Nice little seating area. Got a place for a fire. This makeshift seat here. <laughs> hey, Bill. I love this little outdoor area that you made. Is this uh, like a prep or something like that? Kind of pick your vegetables and then clean them up and get them ready to go on like true farm to table. Veggie washing and sorting place. I love it. I love it. We got baby number two over here. I like this. I like how people have made these very, mm, what's the word? Sacred, hallowed ground. Oh, we got a, we got a nice little little area over here you have tucked away. You know, I want to challenge everybody like on your plots. There's so much there's so much that you can do with the space that you have and so many natural elements. Just every now and then go take a walk around your plot um, outside of the, the boundaries and stuff. You can find so many amazing things here. All right. So we're going this way. Oh, looks like we got an escalator. I mean, that's that's one heck of a heck of a setup you got. Love the picnic table. That's adorable. Oh, I'm sorry. I kicked you off. My bad. Really fun to kind of get a good view up here. I wish that Paleo had a proper lookout tower. That would be fun, you know? Not that we would have any need for a lookout tower, like in this setting, but it is kind of fun. Yeah, and second floors. Absolutely. Absolutely agree about second floors. That's a beautiful plot. Very beautiful plot. Make sure I found you. There you are. Those of you who are still here, make sure you go ahead and give the video a like. Let me know in the comments what you thought, what would you incorporate in your own plot, and uh, what are some things that you think are missing in Paleo right now. Hermione, thank you so much for letting me stop by. Uh, it's a pleasure. I love the bow emote kind of way I say thank you. And I will see you all for the next Paleo tour. Until next time, take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>